All right, guys, I just had my first bite. Ooh, this feels like a good one. Throwing a couple chubby hoppers with some droppers and uh, finding some success. So thank you guys for all the support on the channel and let's get them. Good morning, welcome to another episode with Real Hustle. We just rolled up here in South Park, Colorado, hooked the boat on the back of the truck, and we're gonna be doing some fly fishing at Spinny Mountain Reservoir with our friend Elijah. Looking for big trout, pretty much just anything that comes our way. So thank you guys for all the support. Subscribe if you haven't, and let's get right to the fishing. should be coming down that dock any moment now and then we'll be getting out there and trying to bend some of these fly rods. So I got my seven weight Lampson Guru with my seven weight St. Croix. I've got two hoppers with a single dropper and we're gonna see if we can start putting some fish in the boat. All right, guys, Elijah's on to the first fish. Ever so slightly ate my dropper, guys. Really subtle, pretty cool. Benny called out the, the spot and I uh, threw it in front of him. And Drag him right over by this when you can. Ate my dropper, Benny called the uh, the spot. Sweet fish, we're on the board boys. First fish of the day. So I'm standing up on my polling platform right now and I'm able to kind of spot these fish cruising the shoreline. And... All right guys, I just had my first bite. Ooh, this feels like a good one. Been a little slow for Benny B, but finally got a good drop. And this fish is way in my backing. I got a feeling it's a good one. Big fish. Heavy fish. Ladies and gentlemen, we've come to the conclusion that uh, females, uh, they like to fight. They love to fight, and much more so than males. Males typically get over problems quickly, you know, when you hook them. But females, they, they hold a grudge, so. Get him. Big old beautiful female, probably six pounds, 24 inches, quick slow-mo, we'll get that fish back. All right guys, just got hit again. Hit my dropper. Looks like a smaller fish than the last one, but still a good one. This one's fighting like a male. Beautiful day out here in South Park, just bending some fly rods. Just can't go wrong. 
Throwing a couple chubby hoppers with some droppers and uh, finding some success. So thank you guys for all the support on the channel and let's get them. just got this nice buck he's stumpy he's probably only 18 inches or so but just nice little fatty all right guys elijah just hooked up got a little crazy for a second had to put a rod in my mouth <laughs> We're gonna edit that out. Elijah likes rods in his mouth. <laughs> hey man, it's not PC. You're gonna get canceled, bro. But yeah, in all seriousness, yeah, my it shot down and my dry fly shot under. It looks like it's on the shallow one. Cool. Nice, like. Nice buck, yeah, 20 inches probably, 19, 20. It was on a shallow one. Hustle duck. Drag him right on top. Sweet. Shout out to Travis at uh, <coughs> Chasing Tail Jigs. You know, he ties these flies for us and uh, they work. So go give him a visit in Wheat Ridge. It's an Antero fish. Yeah, totally. There he is, guys. Just a quick release. Yeah, boys. Nice two foot female, just uh, smashed my hopper. Felt good, stoked on real hustle. All right guys, I just got dropped right after Elijah got that last female. Got slow on us for a little while, but you know what? starting to see some action again and we're thankful for that. South Park's always a blessing whether you're catching or not so here we go. Alright guys best buck of the day so far beautiful fish I mean look at that fish. I don't know, but I just, I think I got dropped. Yeah, I got dropped. I just saw my, yeah, sick jump. It's a tarpon. I got in the weeds. Ah, oh, I think I lost him. All right, guys, we're getting ready to go check a new spot. We gave this spot some time and uh, see if we can get on some more fish. What do you say, Elijah? Let's go get them. Just got nailed on my hopper. It looks like a big fish, trying to keep him out of the weeds. 
Just got to the new spot. Watched him come up and slurp, it was awesome. Out here on the polling platform, just getting it done real hustle style. <clears throat> Looks like a big buck. Boom. All right guys, super stoked on that buck. Probably 22, 23, five pounds, just beautiful fish. Um, definitely hit hard. Ended up being on the Hustle Duck Coronamid. Can't go wrong. Elijah just got whacked. Best to keep it up high out of the weeds. Almost in backing, He's trying. Orvis uh, H3 3D Pro with a uh, Orvis Mirage 3 reel with the scientific angler floating trout line. And I'm in backing now. Fish ate right off, right off of us. Does not want to stop. Back to main line. It's a fine line between straight up and keeping out of weeds and side pressure. You know, you really gain on fish with side pressure, um, but you got to keep them out of the weeds. And side pressure doesn't work to keep them out of the weeds. So, all right, guys, we got them in the net. Nice, uh, you know, 22, 23 inch hen. Ate my dropper, took me into backing, fun fight, fun fish, loving it. Guys, I just set the hook and I've never caught one of these here. That's a little perch. I didn't even know those were in here. So we were able to rope two or three hogs here. We bent a hook out and lost one, but I caught that little perch, which was pretty radical. Now we're gonna go try a whole nother spot. It's currently 2.45, so there's still some time in the day. See what we can get into. So we just saw a pike, so we're gonna troll this for a second. Elijah's gonna hold on to it and uh, see if we can get our pike on while we go back to a trout spot. So it's getting pretty windy now, but uh, we're still out here, so. Let's see if we can hold up another fish. It's gotten a little slow on us. So we found a little calmer area. This might be one of our final spots of the day. Just watching my hopper with an eagle eye. All right, so I just hit it with the last lucky cast. We got a couple minutes and we're out of here. Well, I apologize. We couldn't get you one more. All right, everyone, thanks for watching another episode with Real Hustle. It was a very long day. Our alarm went off at 3.30 a.m. so that we could be at the reservoir locked and loaded by 5.30 a.m. We fished all the way till 7.30 p.m., so it was a 14-hour day on the water. Me and Elijah had a great time. We caught some great fish, but there were some slow periods. We also caught that surprise perch, which was pretty cool. Some great trout were caught, some good times were had, and we really appreciate all your support on the channel and watching the video all the way through. Subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you guys in a couple days for another episode with Real Hustle.